we are super excited because I actually got a huge box sent to me from a subscriber who watches me who is from Romania. So Dan Alexandru, I'm probably going to butcher this, Ionescu, does that sound right? Or Ionescu? I Ionescu? Yeah. From Becaresti, Romania? <laughs> <laughs> sent me a like a five pound box of Romanian snacks. Yeah, he sent uh, with this a letter. Here is your box of sweet and salty snacks from Bucharest, Romania. I'm really looking forward to seeing you sample them and watching the video. Some of these, like the Rom chocolate, are throwbacks to my childhood about 25 years ago, so I absolutely had to include them in the box. Huh. By the way, the word Rom, though similar to Romania, actually means rum. Ooh. So expect to find rum flavor in some of the sweets. I won't say any more because I want everything to be a surprise. Hope you enjoy. Alex. So he goes by Alex. Nice. So he goes by Alex. So Alex from Romania, this is your box. And, and thank it you. it is full. So <laughs> this might actually end up being like a two-part series because they're... This is full. It is a lot of snacks. But can we challenge? We Yes, we will challenge because I am the Romanian king. Because I will win. She's not going to win. <laughs> Whoever eats the most wins. Go. Oh, well then you'll win for <laughs> sure. <Here we> <laughs> That's not fair. So, I will let the lady go first. So, competition-wise. You're going to... Let you choose first. Are, are you going to like shake it and think things are going to move around? Because <laughs> this box Total. is oh, busting at the seams. Total mystery. So we'll each choose and by mutual decision, we will decide who actually picked out the better snack. Mutually decide. Fitty fitty. Have you guys really ever seen fitty, a mutual fitty, decision? Fitty fitty. fitty. It's more like I win. A hundred percent zero percent. Okay, let's go, let's go. Don't look. I'm going all the way to the bottom of the box. That's kind of cheating. How's that cheating? I don't know yet. I, I haven't, uh, haven't I went to the very yet. bottom of the box. All right. Oh, Eugenia? That's what I was going to say, Eugenia. Or Eugenia. <laughs> I'm going to go with Eugenia. That's Romanian. Ugania. Or not. Ugania. Um, it, it's some kind of biscuit because I can read biscotti. Cool. Ugania. And it looks like it's got some kind of cream in it. It's probably fantastic. Okay, let's get to this. Because the best snacks yeah. are anything outside of the U.S. Oh, <laughs> these look delish. Oh, there was a subscriber who told me why the U.K. snacks and the European snacks are so good. Because in order for the U.K. laws... The government says you must use a certain percent of whole chocolate, like real stuff, in all their sweets. Oh. The U.S. uses like 85, 90% processed chocolate, chemically tasted chocolate. But the U.K., it's like 40 or 50%, 60, like pure chocolate. Huh. So that's why their sweets are so much sweeter and more bold in the taste because the government makes them use a certain amount of pure, real chocolate. A subscriber email me about that. I was like, oh, so that's why your sweets are so good. Because huh. you actually use real products. Well, Not products, but what's the word I'm thinking of? Products. <laughs> uh, like true source? No, like you 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 make something and you put in like the pieces. <laughs> you know, so anyway, let's do this. I don't know what you're talking but, about. But yeah, like this will taste really good because they, they make them, I'm sure in Romania it's probably the same way, where they're forced to use better quality ingredients. Ingredients is the word I'm thinking of. Okay. Let's go. Uh, After my little... This is, the other end of it is in the packaging. Ooh. It broke off. But it's like a cookie, bis like a biscuit with a Ooh. chocolate in the middle. Mm-hmm. That's good. I'm gonna eat your little piece what of it. What is that? Like, that's good. Is that rum? Is that rum that we're tasting? I don't know. That's really. I've never had anything that tasted like this. I haven't either. I think it is a little bit of rum in there. Like, yeah, it is. That, it wasn't what I expected it to be, rum. and then it was like a wonderful surprise. 
because like the outside of this is very flaky, mm. uh, very flaky. The inside is smooth, creamy. I'm trying mm. to describe this professionally. And it has, yeah, that's, that's rum. This is really good. Mm hmm I like that. Me too. Winner. I haven't chosen yet. <laughs> I still win. No. That's good. You even said you were going to eat my my broken crumbs in I'll there. I you have it. It's so good. That's different. Like, that's why outside of the U.S. snacks, mm. they're all the best. <laughs> like, that is so... That's good. Like, the flavor is so bold. It's an intense and... flavor. It's not overpowering, no. but it's just very strong... But... It's not good flavor. It it's not taste chocolatey. Chemical. Like there's chocolate in it, but it's not chocolatey. Some, but some, you've got the rum with the yeah. sweetness of the the biscuit. Oh, that's, that's good. good. Good stuff. Challenge. I think I'm winning that one. You're making a whole ruckus in there. Ooh, uh, somebody went for chips. Imagine that. We got. Cracks original bacon chips, I guess. I can't read the bag because most of it is in Romanian. Like all the, the back of it. Oh. So I can't really read it, but obviously it's probably bacon flavored chips. How did how do they do their calories? Is it energy as well? Oh, there it is. Energetica. <laughs> Val Valerie Energetica. <laughs> Valerie Energetica. <laughs> Nailed it. Nailed it. Ooh, smells like actual, like, hmm. like. I don't know. They look like little pieces of bacon, though. They're kind of cute. <laughs> it smells like a restaurant from my childhood. What? I can't place it. Huh. Okay. Let's try this. Can't place it. They're kind of cute. They look like little pieces of bacon. Those are good. I like them. Those are good. It's not like an overpowering flavor. It's good and crunchy. Those are good. I still think I won. Here's one though. It's good though. Yeah, I, those are good. I, I like those. But yeah, hers was like that's that would be awesome with just a sandwich. Hers was phenomenal though. Yeah, but those are good. One, zero. You can't peek. I'm not peeking. <laughs> Don't close your eyes. <laughs> why? Why are you trying to stick your tongue in my nose or something? What are you doing? That's so gross. <laughs> Don't close your eyes. Oh. Halvia? Halva. Yep, Halva. Halva. Kakako. That means chocolate. chocolate. <laughs> Halva. This is heavy. Like, it's got some weight to it. I wonder if we're going to need something to, um... Yeah, let's, let's see how many pounds it is. Ready? Yep. 7.1 ounces. Woo! So a pound is 16 ounces, so that's almost half a pound. That's almost half a pound. <laughs> that's a lot. It's almost half a pound. Like that's it's a like lot. it's not that big, but it's almost half a pound. Is it like fudge or something? I don't know. That's hard. Okay, let's see. Oh. That's different. It, this is this is what it looks like. Like what a, is it? <laughs> I don't know. I think we might need a knife to cut it. Do you have like a plastic silverware in here? I got kind of clean knives. <laughs> oh. Um. Well, hold a moment, and I will go get a knife and like a paper plate or something. Okay. This might make a mess. So while you're gone, I'll sing to them. The kitty cat's waiting outside. Probably he's hungry. I just finished my song. You missed it. Phoenix said he wanted to um, come in and, and taste some treats, too. Cat's not hungry. I'm hungry. Cat's Starving. always hungry. Starving. 
Okay, here we, we go. Oh. On the plate though. So we're got we're cutting into Halva. 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 Helga. Oh. It's soft. It. It. Of course, they can't really see. But <laughs> well, I can't hold it like up and it cut it. Cuts. It doesn't. It almost cuts like a cookie. Okay, there you go. Oh, and it crumb. It's crumbly. It's crumbly. Oh my gosh. That's different. It like turns to like um like real velvety in your mouth. Whenever you chew it, it tastes like you're chewing ice cream that has too much ice in it. No, I mean, <laughs> <laughs> you, know, you know what I'm saying? Like like the homemade stuff, it, it, if a person puts too much ice in it, <laughs> like crystals yeah. in it, this kind of tastes like ice cream with okay. too much ice, like chunks in it. This has some kind of nut in it. The flavoring though, I'm not so on the flavor though. The flavor is like, eh. I thought it was going to be more chocolatey. But I kind of like it. It's not bad, but. It's not bad at all. I couldn't eat the whole thing. Cause oh my gosh, this is big. The flavoring is kind of strange. Not a, I can't, it's different. Yeah, it's not, it's not my favorite. It's very I don't strange. even know how to describe that flavor. Um, like the aftertaste of that, it's gritty, at least in my mouth. But then it turns velvety. Kind of, I don't know. Yes, it does. It's like ice cream with too much ice in it. Trust me on this. That's a very strange way to describe something, but okay. So that's not my favorite. Okay. Well, no. Nope. <laughs> in front of me. Well, I'm trying to find a place for it. Okay. Now I'm going to go in and destroy this round. Here we go. Oh. We have an Eddie Puff marshmallow biscuit with strawberry flavored sprinkles. There was actually several in here. We can each have our own because I'm sure this will make an extreme mess. Don't look. Yep. I remember seeing a couple of those pinky things in they there. They look like they um, have marshmallow on top of them. Like a marshmallow on top of a cookie. We'll each have our own Eddie Puff. Eddie Puff. Oh, the bottom has like a really pretty swirly design on it. You gotta show the bottom too. Look at that. Ooh, How it smells is nice. That? An Eddie Puff. Mm -hmm. Smells uh, strawberry-ish. Well, because it's strawberry like, flavored. Like a strawberry milkshake. Mmm. Mm-hmm. That's good. I win. You do win that one. That's yeah, good. Mm -hmm. The marshmallow is not like super I'm gonna eat the whole chewy thing. thing. It's not well, weird like a moon pie. Well, I like moon pies though. I, I like moon pies. I think they're nasty. I do. I don't like them. They're right, good. Eddie Puff was good. One one. I win. Mmm. I'm invincible. Okay. I'm the god of thunder. Okay, Thor, here we go. Gusto. Cheesy poofs. Puff. Puff Cheesy poofs. Puffaluti? Cheesy poofs. Puffaluti. It has a dog on them. It does have a dog on them. The dog's name is Gusto. Gusto. Awesome. Of course, she chooses the cheesy poofs because she knows that I love cheesy poofs things. I hey. love all like cheesy. Girls got to do what a girl's got to do. I love cheesy snacks. Oh. Mmm. Smells like white cheddar cheese. Smells strange. Strange? They're like soft. They like evaporate. That's different. One chew and it's gone. Huh. I, Those one. are fun. <laughs> it's like. Fun. This evaporates. That's amazing. It's gone. I like it. Like you, like you don't even swallow. It just vanishes in your mouth. That's 
so what weird. Is that? I don't know, but it's fun. Like it's gone. It doesn't have doesn't have much flavor to it though. Look, it not has, very much. It has Phoenix's name on the back side of it, only spelled Phoenix. differently. And his is spelled without the O in Phoenix. It's different. I've never had anything like this. Okay, but I keep going back for more, and I really like it. Gone. <laughs> it does. You don't even have to swallow no. it. It's just like it just dissolves melts. in your mouth. Those That's are strange. Those are cool. Um. Okay. That's a big old bag. That's of a huge puffs. bag. Those are interesting. I like them. They're very. We don't have anything like that here in the U.S. As far as I know. Uh, as far as I know, either. It's different. It's it's not like a cheesy poof at all. At all. You like those. You just set them over there by you. <laughs> <laughs> Guess who's winning this well, round? So I, so I must counter chip a chip then. I have to counter. I have to have no choice. There's a lot of stuff in that box. Oh. We got... We went from a dog to a bear. Humbar ketchup style... Bears. <laughs> Bears. <laughs> Bears. Well, the ketchup. Smells like ketchup. Very humble, baby. <laughs> they like kind of look like bears. <laughs> <laughs> Is that what they're trying to? Yeah, they are. <laughs> Mine's like my bear has been decapitated. <laughs> my bear is missing his leg. Ooh. They're good though. Look, he has a smile and I know. I feel that. <laughs> Ooh, I like these. I like those too, but those were more fun. I like these better. Because they're so interesting. But these have a better flavor to the them. The flavor of these oh, wow. are better. The flavor's good. But the texture of those is more interesting. It's different. These taste good. These have a good flavor to them. They do. Very good flavor. The other ones are different. They're interesting. I'll let you have this round. Okay. You can be 2-1. I agree. 2-1. <laughs> of course two, you two agree. You Oh, you... You look, baby. I, well, hold on. I had to shake it up now. It's not going to go anywhere if you shake it. Okay. You probably just decapitated the old bear. Those have really good flavor to them. Really good flavor. I like those. They're fabulous. Whoa. What do we have here? Something with prunes in it. That's a huge package. <laughs> yes, it is. Corn. 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 Cornholio. That does not say cornholio. Are you sure? <laughs> corn, cor, cornol, you don't, cornorte? I don't know. You don't watch Beavis and Butthead? No, I don't watch Beavis like, and... Cornholio. <laughs> you don't watch Beavis. I am cornholio. You're so weird. <laughs> I won't finish the rest of the quote because it's this probably is a family channel. I am cornholio. <laughs> now you're going to have some kid going out there looking at what cornholio is. Actually, probably more will be adults will play. <laughs> <laughs> probably. Like, what is? Oh, we need a Beavis Cornholio. Oh, they smell sweet. They smell like rum. It I like, smells like I very, like the last rum. very strong of rum. I like the last rum tree. Oh, that that has rum in it. Oh yeah, that's got rum. Let me clear my palate. Mm. So this reminds you me a lot the of rum. the very first treat. Or. There's a lot mm -hmm. of rum in that. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of rum in that. I like it though. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of rum in that. It's are like you, a treat. Are you drunk? Maybe. <laughs> Cornholio. <laughs> I like those. Mm -hmm. They're good. They're good. Very sweet. Sweet? It's like a sweet rum, which is what he said. Mm -hmm. But I couldn't eat a whole bunch of them though, because I, I would get tired of them quickly. I eat like a lot of them. Well, then don't eat a lot of them. Just have one a day. It's it's like, like a, your vitamins. It's like a snack. Oh, I have those twice a day. Oh, to keep me healthy and strong. <laughs> but like those, like after a couple, I'd be like, okay, I'm done, because of the flavor and the overpowering. I liked them. Okay, let me counter that with some awesome. You and I are very different in our treats. Ooh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Nestle Joe XXL Cocoa Milk Chocolate Crema de Cacao 
chocolate cu la pare tu buck. <laughs> Nailed it. I saw Nestle on the back. Nailed it. Oh, Nestle's on the front too. I did a good, a good job with that deciphering, I think. I stopped listening. Oh, I didn't. That's big. They don't really smell much, though. Nope, they don't smell. There's your half. I don't want a whole half. Yeah, you do. That's a, that's a big half. Because you're starving. Yeah, I look like I'm starving. That's good. Yes, that's really good. Uh-huh. This is actually like good chocolate. This is good. It's a Nestle, but Nestle in like Europe has to use better chocolate by like government law. And you can tell it's like it's not our chocolate. It's I love these wafery things. Oh good. That's good. Mm-hmm. So uh Dang it. Is that a three one? Yes. <laughs> it started out with a bang. Oh, it's, it's my turn to go first. Because I won that round. Oh. I think it's the first time I've actually gone first because I haven't stopped him going first. Uh -uh, you just... Oh. <laughs> yeah, probably. You've been cheating. Let's see. It's not really cheating. Cheating. You're taking a long time. We'll go for a chip. Grand Papa Ku Maslane Fin Gutos Nobu. Wow, this is going to be it. <laughs> <laughs> try to pronounce it. Just try. Cabrige Frog Egziti Kun Vin. Nailed it. <laughs> That's a whole lot of tongue twisted there. Nailed it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yep, nailed it. This is terrible. I'm really good at pronunciation. It smells weird. It smells like olive oil. Is that what it is? Yep. Is this this is the pretzel I think, right? Don't you see the all the olive branch? No. Hmm. Not a huge fan. Hmm. That one's different. Not a huge fan. It's kind of like a pretzel texture. Kind of. Kind of. But it's not crunchy crunchy. No. It's crunchy but not crunchy crunchy. And then there's just a subtle tint of olive oil Something. to them. Hmm. Not a fan. That's different. I'm not a fan. It's not bad. It's not bad. It's just... It's not, it's, it's not what our palates are used to mm -mm. here in the U.S. Like, we're not used to that kind of texture and flavoring. We're not used to it. Different. <laughs> <laughs> you, because you looked first. Battle chip the chip. You, you looked first. That's not, she's cheating. She's cheating. Best foods, lasso peanuts. Right now it's what? 3-1 or 4-1? 3-1. Three three one. One. Okay. Lasso peanuts. She shoes like a chip and a peanut. Like my loves. Did you pronounce it? I did. Lotto peanuts. There's probably some more words on there. Oh yeah, there's there's more words. Oh yeah. Snack ku pasta di rawhide. Arahide. Rawhide. You, you did okay on that. Thank you. you did okay. Sniff it. Oh, you're gonna like these. They look like tater tots. Smell like peanut butter? Is that what it smells like? They look like tater tots. Oh, it's peanuts. Smells like peanut butter. <laughs> <laughs> I just got it. I said lato peanuts. <laughs> because you make peanut butter from peanuts. I wow. You just figured that out? Well, I knew I just didn't realize that my brain wasn't processing. <laughs> oh my god. Smells like peanut butter. Smells fabulous. That's rich in peanut butter. Peanut flavored. I shouldn't say peanut butter. Peanut flavored. It's like a peanut butter cheesy poof without cheese. Mm hmm Like a peanut butter poof. It tastes like a... It looks like a... Tear shot. 
Yep. You I like it that round. Uh -huh. Three, two. Those are good. Mm -hmm. It's like a peanut butter poof. I've never had these before. I've never seen these before. That's, That's good. They don't make them in the U.S. Oh. Our snacks here are, are uh, inferior to lots of other snacks. Oh, I won. Huh. Imagine that. Let's try. <laughs> you said imagine that. Was it two, three? Three, two. Three, three, two. No? Oh yeah, you had to <laughs> look at me like I changed my mind. Uh Pretzel Crackers Q Tarte. You, you did a, a good job on that. Tarte. Pretzel crackers Q Tarte. Tarata. Tarata. Uh, you gotta put some zing into your words. Oh. Whew. I thought I was gonna bust the whole bag. Oh, I did kind of bust it down yeah, the side. Yeah, you busted it. Smell it. Sniff. Smells like a wheat, um, mm. like a wheat cracker. These would be probably good on hummus or whip hummus. They're very hard. It tastes like we put onto your salads, those little brown things. Oh, the little sesame things? That's yeah. What, that's what this is. Yeah. You're right, it does. These are good. That's what it is. You could crunch these up and put them on your salad, but yep. I bet they'd be really good in hummus. Yeah, they would. Oh, they're good. <laughs> it's a smiley face. <laughs> Smile. I like those. Good. Good. Mm-hmm. They're not like... Not like wow. Wow, but, but they're good. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. and so let me counter that with. Don't look. Why am I not looking? Don't look. Yes. Du Sierra Felalaco did it 1918 at Monterey La Moda. Jelleria su kusu de fruki de padra. Nailed it. It's like gummies. <laughs> I'm still like, what? What did, what just did you say? Oh, speaking Romanian. <laughs> Good enough. Ooh, so nice. Oh, those do smell nice. Let me clear my palette. There's different colors. It smells oh, very they fruity. look like they look like um the inside of a grapefruit. Oh, three came out. Oh, those are good. Ooh. Oh, that's good. Dang it! You won that round. You like melt. Ooh. Oh, dang! Those are good. Very, very sweet. That'll put you into it's, the shoe. It's not long. a gummy either. Uh uh. It looks like it is, but it's not a gummy. Mmm. Mmm. That's really good. That's good. I win. These are mine, though. Four two. These are mine. Too bad. These are good. Go. It's your turn. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. What is that? What is that? Ooh. There's, there's, there's like a log in here, like a log. A log. Oh, I'm gonna save that though. Oh yes. Oh, that's the rom thing. Oh yeah. What else do we have that rom was rom? Cell dubla, to oh. batoina. Oh, in in his letter. Yeah, where he says the rum actually it means rum. rum. So this will be it's strong in rum too. a rum chocolate. Is this authentic rum, it says. There's no hints because I can't read Romanian. I, mean, I, <laughs> I can translate it, but I can't understand it. <laughs> Cause I, what? Because I speak it like a rum del sur dubla. 
but I don't actually understand what I'm saying. <laughs> but then you're not translating it. It's a big piece. Oh my. Break. Oh. Ooh. Well, that's different. I thought it was going to be like a really hard break. Sniff it. Sniff it. <laughs> 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 Smells, smells like chocolate. Very chocolatey. Mm. That's a lot of rum. That's a lot of rum. That's a lot of rum. That's a little too much rum. <laughs> That's a lot of rum in that. Oh, wow. boy. Wowza. That's a little too much That's rum. That's a lot me. of rum in that. <laughs> I'm going to say wow. too much rum. It might taste like I just took a shot of rum. That's what it tastes like. I don't taste chocolate. Mm -mm. I just All taste, I taste is rum. rum. Mm -hmm. I, wow. That's strong. There's a texture of some kind of a chocolate, but it's just rum. I'm going to put that down. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how I feel about that one. Wow. That's different. Wow. That's, that's really different. That tastes like I'm just drinking rum. That's very strong. Let's go for... No. Wanted Pops Caramel. It's like peanuts and chocolate. I'm the peanut guy. You totally cheated. I did not You felt the peanuts. You felt them. They're not peanuts. They, They're chocolate balls. Oh, never mind then. Disregard. No, so she didn't cheat, huh? You still, you still cheated. Oh yeah, you still cheated. It smells like chocolate. Sniff it. I don't smell much. Get over the plate. I just made a mess. It's good. That's what I the win. Plate's for. That's really good. Uh huh. I win. Mm -hmm. You're going to like that one. It's crunchy on the outside, chewy on the center, and yummy. That's good. Uh huh. I win. Four three. Three? It was four two. Oh, that's right. So after this, we have now done seven rounds so far, and I'm up four three. And there is still a whole ton. Of treats. There's still a lot of stuff left. There's probably enough for like six or seven more rounds to to go in. I'm kind of on a sugar. Yeah, I'm on like a sugar rush right now. Mm -hmm. So that was fun, and it was a uh, very different chocolates we've never had it's before. It's like really cool to try things that like the rum stuff we have was very never strange. Had. Well, never and those had puffy that. things puffy that things like just dissolve, like dissolved in your mouth. Very different. They were so different. So, but we will finish this box though. Yes. Like, we will finish it in a future video and we'll see who wins the rest of it. Yeah. But I'm up 4-3. We're going to continue the challenge into the next video because he doesn't get to win this video and then go to another one and think he's going to win too. Double win. No. So, we're going to continue the challenge. Continue it. And I'll just continually win. I'm only one behind tying you. And one's a lot more than being tied. <laughs> yep. Okay. So yeah, we're kind of treated out, salted out, chocolate out, and rummed out. So we're yeah, going to this, take a little breather. It's a lot, but thank yeah. you, Alex, oh, yeah, that's so awesome. much. This was this extremely like fun. Crazy good stuff. And different, different stuff. Different. Such different stuff. Which Textures is, uh -huh. and flavors that we don't have here in the... US like this doesn't exist here. Kind of nice. No, it's kind of refreshing to have things that are completely different and you know some of the stuff yeah we like love actually and some, and stuff some of like, it was like yeah because our palates uh, aren't used to it mm -hmm. we're not used to those textures and flavors it's just to us it's foreign yeah and our palates are just like screaming at us what's this our brain's saying that's weird but it's good. But it's good. And some stuff is just kind of like <laughs> like that rum bar, which is probably the 
my least favorite was the rum. Just because it's pretty much you're eating rum. Yeah. <laughs> straight up, we ate like straight rum. It was that was different. It was different. But like I what, wish out of out of everything that we had, uh, what would, has been your favorite so far? Least favorite is the rom. I have to agree with that. Favorite? There's been a lot of just good stuff. I know which one my favorite is. My favorite was the very first thing that we opened. Mm. The Eugenia. That was probably, well, that was my favorite out of everything that we've tried so far. I'd say, honestly, the best flavoring of anything. Flavor flavor is the ketchup chips really good because i'm a chip guy these had very good just good solid flavor those were good but, but I, mean, I also really like these things too that's like a sugar bomb right there it is a big sugar yeah. bomb but, but it is good i don't have like an actual favorite though there was three or four that i really liked so I really can't choose a favorite at this time. I really can't. But the best flavor, in my opinion, was the Poon Bar Ketchup Style just because the flavoring was so good of a flavor. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. Yep. Yeah. So we will be back with part two of this box because we have a whole other video left. So we will yeah. be back to finish the duel.